Dragon Ball lives forever. Of course, first of all, rest in peace, Akira Toriyama Sensei. Obviously, no, who couldn't? It's sad, honestly, this episode. But we're here, guys. Which is new Dragon Ball, which of course is Akira Toriyama's last Warcraft. He actually did write the storyline, uh, and it's it was emotional. I said first, guys, I was trying to find my. I have a four Dragon Ball, you know, like the actual, you know, model after, of course, the classic Dragon Ball with the four stars in it. And I was like, where is it? Because I want to hold it in my hands when I start the video talking about Dragon Ball Daima. And I was like, wait, actually, I rather hold my. <laughs> I was like, wait, no, yeah, screw that. <laughs> I have something better to hold. Dragon Ball is nice. Come on, man. Stop lagging so much. It's really hard to watch this episode. I mean, it be genuine, it's hard to watch. It's just so many people that want to watch Dragon Ball. I'm here, right? With freaking 18. We read episode of Dragon Ball Daima. And as soon as he kind of got into the good bits with the new demon lady coming in, the whole wire first, like, it is unwatchable. It's so goddamn popular that I'm sitting here being like, I guess they just turn off this timer and everything because it's like, yeah, because it just froze for me. I, keep, I try to refresh it. I just can't watch it, okay? It is goddamn too popular. So I'm gonna, I will, I will add this, right? But I, I just can't do with the timer. We will have to like take a break and I will, I will come back to the window. I, I will try to watch the rest of the episode in like 10 minutes now. It's just way many people watching it right now. It just doesn't work. It just froze for me. Oh, there we go. It's evil muscular boo. There we go, yeah. But heaven, yeah, that's true. We haven't seen Kid Boo yet, guys. We haven't seen Kid Boo yet. Here comes uh, Gotenks and so on. We haven't seen, we haven't got the Kid Boo yet. That's very true. Maybe it's a longer episode, honestly. It's like almost 10 minutes now, but we haven't seen Kid Boo yet. So we're clearly gonna, this is, recap's gonna be, for, it's gonna be super long because this is cute though, seeing Kid Boo. For that matter, if you played Able Fighters, Kid Boo was by far my favorite character. I love playing Kid Boo. I was like freaking best player in the world, Kid Boo, man. I played Kid Boo for like 100 hours. Love playing Kid Boo. Now, now that the episode starts here, guys. Yeah, yeah. He goes on a really evil woman. He's like, oh, 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 oh. So you got Foxy Lady. There's a Foxy Evil guy coming in here. Oh, she looks really evil. She goes, I can't throw you my evil eyes, man. This is some evil new waifu, man. This is the best new character in the season, man. Evil demon waifu in Dragon Ball. And she's all like, oh, 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 I got a plan for you, demon lord, yeah. How about if we defeat the, the, the super sire? Oh, no, oh, no. <laughs> Come on, this is the best character, easily. Oh, yes. Oh, Arara, demon lord. Arara, indeed. Oh, honestly, the more I look at this woman now, she looks a lot like, like, you know, Castlevania Dracula. But, you know, gender, yeah, a little bit like a Kai, e evil Kai Dracula. She's got the crimson cape. The evil la 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 laughter. She do the, the the cap thing, just covering over her body, be like, ho ho ho, you know. Yeah, like she looks like some kind of like vampire lady. Um, but I do think that a lot of like Japanese, like uh, obviously like Morrigan and so on. I think a lot of like Japanese uh, demon lord ca characters, right? Succubus characters also trash into being a vampire. Yeah, I think it's a lot of that in a lot of anime, mangas, also of course video games, uh, where you have like a demon lady. That is like, well, she kind of feels like a vampire lady, right? Soccer boss slash vampire, and they kind of they kind of mix all this together. <laughs> Honestly, this is died. <laughs> it just died. It's so people. There's so many people watching this thing that I can't watch it. I'm trying to watch it. I saw the evil hot lady, I you know, coming in here, and then she doing all this stuff. And I'm back with up the last time. We are back with the hot waifu. I love her, the best new character. Oh, ara, ara. come on, she's back. Ara, ara. Demon lady, she's all like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this is what I'm here for, baby. Oh, oh come on, demon lord. Well, yeah, she's all super dramatic, too. I love her. I'm in love with this new character. Jesus Christ, I love her so much, man. Yeah, oh my God, she's the best character. Who's voicing her? Who's voicing her? I love her so much, man. Jesus Christ, I'm in love with her. I need to buy a figure immediately. She's my new 18. Oh my god, I can't wait for fan versus her, man. She's freaking badass. Okay, now she leaves here as well. Yeah, she's obviously, she's the real antagonist, not the demon lord. No, she's the real one. Yeah, she provoked him to be like, do this for me, demon lord. Now I guess the demon lord is gonna go and transform Goku's kids or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Also, the train is always. Trillin is like, those guys never quit. We're back, guys. Yeah, I took the break here, but now we have Goku and Vegeta. They are, you know, fight trading is always right. Best bros for life. Yeah, <laughs> so we we'll the break here, but now it looks good here. Now it looks good. Now the animation is there. Yeah, punching his shoulder. Bulma is like, oh, 
He never cares about me that much. He loves Goku way more than me. <laughs> yeah, it's like... They love fighting more than anything else. That's what it does. Mm. Is Trillin the best husband? Probably is, yeah. Probably is, right, yeah. 18 is probably the winner, right? <laughs> but so... Oh, it's Final Flash. Yeah, yeah, Vegeta is doing the classic. Yes. <laughs> Goku's like, yeah, there we go. That's Dragon Ball. Goku's like, that's right. Let's do it. Yeah, come here, ha, me, ha. Goku's just happy. Yeah. Come on. Yeah, so they blast him with a blue coming out of Oh, this is beautiful. Let's go to the tease here. I mean, I, I have seen the trailer, right? Goku's doing a kid or something. Yeah, and he punches Vegeta, of course, in the face after the coming out. Doing the same time, interesting. Ah, uh, there we go. Now we go into the god place. So. You are gonna get attacked by these like aliens or something. They're gonna come here and they're gonna transform into shit or something like that. Yeah, there's some weird shenanigans they're up to right the bat. Buru is so fat, look at that. You filthy Buru so fat. Oh, this is what I said, Oh, You filthy Buru so fat. <laughs> <laughs> What's the problem? You filthy burrito fan! Here we go. So it's God's place. Getting up the air. Old Namikian is there. What's he doing? Oh, he makes like. Says after Dragon Balls again? No, he gets Dragon Ball immediately. Well, he gets Dragon Balls immediately. It's using this Namekian, man. This is some new Namek spell here. Like, I can use summon all Dragon Balls. It's quite convenient if you want well, to have no wish granted. Yeah, I can just summon them all immediately. No matter where they are, I guess. Yeah. Sonnano! Yeah, then there's like, what? This guy's gonna shoot him, man. Old even Namekian. Oh, this guy's like counting them. He's like, it's all seven! It's like, one, two, three, four! Good job, good job. Yeah, so they brought an evil old Namekian to just like be like, oh yeah, bro, we got this. <laughs> He's an evil old laughter. But they're all deactivated though. But I guess he can somehow also activate them. Yeah, he can also somehow activate Dragon Balls. And then of course, I guess now they're gonna, you know, it's gonna be like Dragon Ball GT Elite Balls here. They're gonna wish for Goku to be killed again. Then it's gonna, that's how it's gonna, you know, turn in, right? Goku's gonna be dead. Now they all turn into kids again. Or they're all shibis, rather. Yeah, you pick, pick you as a kid too, right? <laughs> yeah, they're all like shibis now. Goku is a kid, he's going to hell. Uh, I guess the, I guess that guy is kind of like Trunks then, so bring them because Trunks was kind of like in Red Buggy T, you had Trunks doing and stuff. Yeah, now they're going into the Hell Dimension to fight them as well. But it really feels like next episode is going to be with really Star right? Let's be honest here, it feels like next episode. I am getting really hyped up to Goku. Fly, yeah, Goku's flying now here. Oh, the guy's a gun. Okay, here's, yeah, okay. So the, the preview now. Yeah, and Kao Shin is going to be Goku's one. But see, even there must be of trunks because they got a little bit trunk outfit. Okay, let's review it, guys. And I would say immediately, guys, sorry the video is strange, but what can I say? Dragon was way too popular, right? And I started watching it. It was not that fine, honestly. The first, like, 10 or so minutes, it wasn't that good. It was, like, a bit laggy, but it was, like, watchable, right? And it was really tip in the beginning. So I was like, okay, whatever, fine. I can live with this. Kind of like, whatever. But then, when, of course, evil... My new favorite character comes in, even all the sister arrives, and she's all like, ah, never know. Yeah, when she comes in, right, the, it just froze. Yeah, it froze. So after she provoked the demon lord to almost do what he did, right, then I couldn't watch it anymore. So I had to take like a 10, I took like a 15 minute break, went back here, and got back into the episode. <laughs> so, so this video is a little bit like, okay, sorry about that. Yeah, and I, and I, I honestly, I have to say this though, it's a review, right, and I'm with all these guys. I love Dragon Ball. I didn't buy this giant 18 figure for, and I have more than one 18 figure, so <laughs> two 18 figures. But let's be honest here, uh, this episode wasn't that good. I'm saying, guys, I love Dragon Ball, rest in peace, like Toriyama, but this felt like a very much like a recap episode, yeah. I mean, it, it wasn't like terrible, but obviously the first half was just like recap, yeah. The first 10 minutes was just pure, like, okay, we're gonna recap, you know, we're gonna recap it, yeah. It wasn't more than that. Uh, the opening was great, love the opening. Little bit of like a, you know, a lot of callbacks to previous things, so that felt very emotional. Seeing that, uh, it, it was super emotional. Yeah, getting all those old classic scenes right, and again, obviously knowing that Kitty Jones died and 
yeah, it, it was a very emotional, like, uh, you know, and, and obviously it was great because they obviously know that. I mean, they are obviously aware of that, so it's a lot of, like, re you know, callback to previous stuff, right? And I don't think that the opening would have been like that if he was there alive, honestly. I don't think so. I think the opening wouldn't have been as, like, callback, right? You know, as, like, and also emotional to me, but personally, but I mean, I don't think the Dragon Ball opening with Daima here would have been even made like it was, right? If it wasn't because... Unfortunately, again, the characters died again because, I mean, otherwise, it probably be more focused on, you know, the new characters, right? These new characters, the new evil waifu, the demon lord, yada yada, right? Uh, on that stuff. But now it's that they, they know that, okay, we're gonna, like, you know, we're gonna, like, give some kind of a, bit of a tri tri you know, uh, tribute here, right? To Akira's work over the years. So the opening was, uh, the opening, yeah, it was maybe a bit. The opening was, was beautiful in that sense, and it really felt more like, a, okay, it's a tribute here. Uh, we don't care about actually the current season, which is a big daima. The opening is all about, you know, the classic Dragon Ball stuff, right? Showing all different, different old scenes. So it, it was a very nice, like, Akira Toriyama tribute. So, yeah, the opening maybe be a bit watching it, uh, watching it again here now. Uh, it's, yeah, it's emotional. But anyway, but anyway, um, so, so, so that was good. Uh, but otherwise, in the episode, obviously I liked the, the new evil female character. I don't think that she is the main evil, right? She kind of driving him. She's obviously tricking the demon lord to do her bidding. She's the, the real antagonist, right? Uh, yeah, she's the one behind him, basically, tricking him to be e you know, be evil, but to do her stuff. So that's one thing. Uh, it obviously reminds me of Dragon Ball GT, right? Getting back into it, like, and even and the new guy too. He even, as I mentioned it in the last project a bit, but he even looks like Trunks, the last guy coming in. He looks like Trunks a lot too, like his clothing and stuff, and he got a little bit hair of Trunks. And if you see it other or dra like Dragon Quest, uh, for example, there's eight. You have and yellow that looks like Trunks. It's obviously based on Trunks appearance wise. Main character is Gohan and so on. Uh, but yeah, the guys in yellow is, is Trunks, and he had a little bit that feeling too to it. So he had a little bit of like other like because like Kira Toriyama clearly has like a Trunk design. You know what I mean? Like he has used that that the Trunk character template kind of thing several times i mean since dragon ball so it, it had a feeling to me it's like yeah this guy is that guy's a trunk template <laughs> if that makes any sense if you if you see i mean i played all the dragon Quest games if you I'm sorry if you don't know but i you know i'm a huge jrpg fan right of course for Tassel today uh, uh so i played all the, all the games right obviously chrono trigger as well as well right so uh, yeah I, so i've seen all his other like you know different designs i also even played the monsters game dragon quest monster joker and so on which i think is a really great game i love those games yeah the pokemon version of dragon quest uh, and so on etc i digress but it's like i i i, I have that recognize i i, I recognize you know, Toriyama sensei style, you know what I mean? Like, oh yeah, this is that character. <laughs> so so that guy he's the trunks of the of this daima, okay? Trust me, he's adult trunks, you know. Seriously. I've mean, immediately watching the preview that guy's trunks. <laughs> yeah. He's, 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 he's the trunk character. Like immediately. Um But uh, yeah, I think it's been cool that they're going to hell instead, right? It'll be a complete new world. And uh, obviously Toriyama then he he wrote this storyline. Some extent. Uh, that being said, he did, of course, but he, he died. So uh, I guess he probably didn't write everything. We can't assume that, but I'm assuming this is canon, right? Yeah. Um, but all, and all in all, I'm very excited for this episode. I think this was here felt a little bit like a recap, okay? Kind of the previous episode, you know, the opening. Yeah, it felt more tribu tribute. Uh, recap was very long. Too, uh, recap was too long, too well, let's be honest here. I think it's too long, but. Uh, so it feels like next episode is gonna be when it really hits right when they go down there and they start fighting and so on. Uh, I, I would say so. Uh, but anyway, subscribe, like button, have a great day.